and we just received um, a koala crate from KiwiCo for my three-year-old. So we thought we would hop on and review it. I am teaching her at home, homeschooling for part of the time, and she's going to a private preschool for part of the week. Um, and I find that I need to keep her busy uh, on those days when she's home. My family, we have a huge gap between my little three-year-old and my other children. Um, so we are running all the time doing more <laughs> older kid and adult things. And she gets left behind sometimes. So we want to bring some just fun things for her to do and to keep her busy and happy and healthy. This would be... I've tried some other different um, subscription boxes before, and this would be my favorite so far. Um, so that's why I want to do a review. And I'll just say, I have not um, been paid for this at all. They didn't send me anything to do as a review. I did follow a link from um, one of the Duggar girls, Jessa Duggar and watched her little kids play through their first crate. And so I followed a link and um, that's what led to me getting one. So, uh, you know, I'll link that below and maybe you'd like to follow her as well. She has some really nice ideas on there. This is one project that we finished. You can see um, she made a pillow, um, just made a little cloud with a rainbow. Um, she did these shapes all by herself. It's fleece. It's got uh, a Velcro closure here, and these are felt stickers. She actually did almost all of this alone. Once I got her started um, with the first one, I said, now just do them by largest to smallest. And so she did that at three without any help, and then we stuffed it, and it came with the stuffing. So there was one. Um, the second one, we haven't done any more than that, but this is a tote bag that you can make. I'll just scoot it back a little bit. And uh, so we got the tote bag. The tote bag comes with some little um, things that you can place on. And then this is uh, a little squeezy bulb, I would assume, for putting the colors on. Um, and rainbow squares that make the color. This is the instructions that it comes with, and it has um, all what to do. And what I thought was really cool about this is that it has some extra places here that tell you things that you can talk about with your child to teach them. Um, color mixing down there on the bag. Here's a finished product. There's the pillow, and it kind of talked about course the directions how to do it and then adding on to the learning there so that was really nice how to do things and on the back you can see they give you a code so you can find more things to do I thought that was really nice so we did follow that link there is a stained glass um, activity that we're gonna do maybe those go with that um, more in the box. Get out. This is the book that came with. I think you can opt whether or not to get a book or not. Always get the book. I am so happy every time I get the book that goes with it. But it's just about a little boy who sees a rainbow and runs outside. And it's imaginative and so cute. And then in the end it says how he made a rainbow in his own room. And so a little touch of science there, and that's the book that comes with it. This is a laminated sheet for one of the activities. These are die cut shapes for part of the activities. And this is a little booklet that comes with it for the children. And it reminds me of highlights. I don't know, it's, but it's a lot smaller. So this is where a lot of the learning comes in. Uh, there's some little stories. It says read some stories. Here's a little bit of science of rainbows. Seek and find, just for fun. Um, making your own rainbows, how you could do some. 
So there's a little bit more of your science, a little bit did you know there. More activities. This was really nice. More books you can get at the library. And so there, yeah. We really enjoyed that. And so far we have enjoyed um, doing the one project we've done. What was really cool is I followed uh, the link on the back of one of these. It gave a link. Where was that? On this one. It gave a link. And I followed that and it said how you can um, make the, use the crate even. <laughs> Which is pretty cool because you end up at home with all these crates. What do you do with them? And uh, it's a real sturdy little box. Kind of cute. And so I just thought that was really neat and thought I would give a review. Thumbs up. Our three-year-old loved it. I'm sure your three-year-old will love it too. And it makes a great addition. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, leave a comment. And we'll see you next time.